We're back here at the Innovation Lab at Intel's EMEA headquarters in Swindon with Ian. So Ian, can you just tell us a bit more uh, about your project? Um, the project initially was to uh, be able to take a, a rear sense camera um, and mm -hmm. track the person who's in front of the camera and then use the, the platform here. The camera was going to sit on the platform mm -hmm. and then um, we can remotely control the motors that are turning the platform to to point the camera at the okay. person in the in the view. Okay, so it uses uses a camera with a uh, um, a motion sensor or just a uh, just a camera, uh, and then the uh, Intel Edison uh, board just works out the. The Edison board is providing a, a web server in the middle of that. Okay. So I can then send commands from my from my iPad here to to make uh, some send commands to turn the motors um, to do various things. And that would have the camera on board, and that would mm. point the so camera towards the person. So, the so we in in the end product, the the camera would just sit on top of exactly that, of yeah. this, uh, and then just track track your your exactly movement. That, yeah. Okay. So Obviously, because we were just discussing that uh, this is just motion detecting, but with enough um, processing power at the back end, you can also do face. You tracking. could do face tracking dependent upon the, the back end software and on all the front end here that could reduce to just the, the credit card size Edison board. Yeah, sure. Um, if necessary. Uh, okay. So uh, we've got a we've got a camera that can track movement or, or a face. So but what what's the real life uh, application of, of of this project? I think the real life uh, application will be to to home in on that per person that's in front of the camera. Mm -hmm. So you make sure that their face is full on in the screen, mm -hmm. um, see what other things are happening in that screen. Okay, um, like for security purposes? Security cameras, um, anything to see what uh, whether people are going past in, in the street. Mm -hmm. uh, it could be anything. You could be scanning around with a camera across a long street rather mm -hmm. than having a fixed view. Okay, and sort of like maybe retail applications, and people s are, are in front of a, a, a piece of advertising. Well, they could always uh, make gestures. The real sense camera's got gesture mm -hmm. built in, so they could make gestures to buy whatever is is in the window next to it. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, any other applications we could use with this particular? I'm sure we could think of a, a million and one applications. Mm -hmm. Such a, a nice device here. Oh, okay, okay. So, what 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 are what what are the next steps for you now? Uh, now it's all sort of a working prototype. I think the the. The week here has given us the, the ability just to see what processes we can do on the Edison, see how powerful it is mm -hmm. compared to some of the other embedded systems. Um, the next step is perhaps to have a look at the, the credit card size one to, to make it a lot smaller, mm -hmm. um, but then develop it further. So we've got sort of sound and, and other um, applications to be involved with the whole thing. So a security camera, for example, could make noises and send send sounds, send emails to other places mm -hmm. across the web because it's connected to anywhere on the web. It could be anything mm. um, and notify services accordingly. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.